All right, so uh, here's part two of the helmet cooling system. Uh, a lot of you had questions about how it would be hooked up and whatnot, so uh, let me start off with this first. Um, basically, this is the fan system. I kind of made it, uh, set it out of clay. Um, basically, what it is is if you look at the bottom here, there's a little space in between, between the, the top of this and the fan. Now, what that'll do, since I block this off, and if, if I put a piece of... Uh, uh, foam across the bottom of this to seal it. Uh, it'll draw in air from the back. I'd have to cut out two spots here. Uh, this is actually for um, the Chicago style bolts that hold down the center part. So, which I just use like that. Um, and it basically just countersink it. There's a video on it. I'll try and add the link down below somewhere or right about here somewhere. Um, and basically, we're trying to pull air through here and then push it out the top. So, if you seal this across, basically you have this whole area to blow air across now uh, I may have to cut into the back of the helmet a little bit to do that but at least I get some airflow in the helmet I haven't seen very many Iron Man helmets that have uh, fans installed into them um, so uh, but as far as how this would be hooked up uh, this would actually be either hooked up to a uh, Palalu or a Adrena board um, with uh, on one of the channels basically set up as an on or off uh, type uh, accessory. Now, the real proper way to do it would actually be to, to get a temperature sensor and then stick it on the inside of the helmet here uh, in the back or in, in the jaw area up in front. And um, if, it, if the temperature reaches a certain temperature, uh, it tells the Adreno or the Palalu to, to go ahead and kick the fan on. Um, I know that there are certain temperature sensors that you can purchase that are set to certain degrees. So basically, it's uh, if it's below the temperature, the power is not turned on. But once it reaches temperature, it kicks power on and it allows the fan to be operated. So that'd be that'd be one way. Uh, the Adreno or um, Palalu board would be the, the the first, and then the third way would be just a regular switch. So if it gets too hot, you just flick it on, flick it off. So um, hope this helps for you guys a little bit. Um, this is basically, as I said, just a prototype. It's clay. Um, just regular clay so um, just kind of mock it up and um, but yeah so you can also stick your batteries in here as well you can stick your Palalu board in here whatever uh, you're getting nice cool air coming over the top of it so it's not that bad so um, depends on how you want to hook it up but basically that's the pr basic principle of the fan system uh, so basically you draw air from the back of the helmet here in the back um, and then it would draw it in and then over the top of the, the, the face plate. So you get cool cool air running down this way. So, and then you could obviously vent it uh, different ways depending on what you want to do. You could, you know, put little slats in here to push the air down across your face or straight down. It's depending on what you want to do. So, um, hope this guys hope this helped you guys. Uh, as I said, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments down below. Uh, if you haven't done so, like, subscribe. Um, and uh, obviously, as always, guys, do your thing. Thanks.